One of our program's objectives is to offer students the opportunity to gain a critical skill set that is much in demand in the Canadian workforce, and that is visual literacy. Visual literacy is more than just recognizing what you see. I presume you can already do that. But also, it's about being able to describe it, being able to interpret it and its um, range of symbolic meanings. So for example, go to uh, shutterstock.com. It's an image repository that is uh, used for commercial purposes. And type in the first day of school. You and me and have probably everyone else you know has experienced a first day of school. When you look at those image results, which are photographs that commercial photographers have licensed or sold to this company, who then will allow you to purchase them, to include them in your media articles if you're a journalist, on your website if you're a company in need of um, means of visualizing uh, your brand or your look or your people, and a myriad of other purposes that you can probably imagine uh, commercial photography could be used for. When you look at those image results, you will see that the first day of school overwhelmingly is represented by predominantly white nuclear families. So families comprised of a mother and a father and two or three children going to school, on their way to school, experiencing the rituals of the first day of school. Uh, so there's a problem here. From a visual literacy perspective, you will be detecting it in our courses. And uh, that is precisely these image results exclude nearly every other demographic who went to school alongside you. Visual literacy will allow you to not only recognize the sorts of imbalances that might be impacting, if you're a company owner, your brand, because if you don't provide an inclusive shopping uh, or branding experience, you may very well alienate people who are, in this case, not belonging to certain groups. But also, with visual literacy, uh, besides making the world more inclusive, you will also um, be more marketable in a broader career context. Um, the Visual Material Cultures program offers not just a certificate in visual literacy, but also two minors, and we're about to have a major as well with an honors program. Uh, you can actually sign up for a specially designated or created major right now in Visual Material Culture Studies. Material Culture Studies offers a brand new array of really exciting courses. We're finding that uh, the students who take our courses come from all over campus. Many of them will sign up for a minor or a major in, as a way of building uh, more applied and experiential learning into their degree program. In material culture studies in particular, all of our courses offer students the opportunity to gain uh, physical, hands-on, um, skill sets in an array of surprising contexts, uh, go check out our courses and you'll see what I mean. Um, so I hope to see you in my classroom uh, and if you have any questions just reach out to uh, mountae.ca slash vmcs. Thank you.